latest alert weather with Cassie Campbell is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. After widespread rain last night into parts of earlier this morning, we had a lot of clouds throughout our afternoon, still seeing a little bit of some light drizzle, drizzle possible light showers, but we are starting to see that sun slowly come out. The clouds are starting to break up. So headed out tonight, I do have it under the jacket category. Going to want something at least to help as that sun goes down. We are going to drop down into about the 40s overnight tonight, so it's going to feel chilly out there. But as for the next couple of hours, you can see the beautiful sunset behind us. We have those partly cloudy skies in store for us all throughout the evening. And then those temperatures are going to gradually drop down into about the lower 50s by 8, 830 tonight with a nice little breeze out of the southwest continuing with us for our evening. Looking across the heartland on our satellite and radar, can see some of those clouds again starting to break up. The sun can see that sun setting depending on where you're at, but the clouds are going to continue to filter on through with us as we head into Saturday. So we're going to go ahead and kick future cast off around 8 o'clock this evening. Can see some of those spotty showers again, some light drizzle. We have a lot of moisture in the air, so that's helping some of that spotty rain and light drizzle still occur for our evening. As we head into tomorrow morning, tracking mostly cloudy skies for all of our Saturday could wake up to areas of some pretty dense fog too throughout Saturday morning. By the time we get to Saturday afternoon, not seeing a whole lot of clearing with those clouds. Mostly cloudy skies in store for us all throughout the day. And then the chance another round of some brief light showers for Saturday night into Sunday. Sunday morning will start to clear out. That rain will move out really early in the morning. Still seeing some lingering cloud coverage more to our eastern counties, but also ahead of us on Sunday are those winds. The winds are going to start to pick up out of the west as we head into Sunday early morning and into the afternoon there. But as for right now, it's pretty nice out there, especially for the first day of December. We're almost 10 degrees warmer than average for this time of year. 58 here in not here, 58 in Poplar Bluff, that nice little breeze out of the southwest. Planning for it tomorrow when you wake up, we are going to be in those lower 40s with all that cloudiness for us throughout the afternoon. Temperatures increasing into about the lower to mid 50s. We're still going to be slightly above average for tomorrow. With that chance for a little bit of rain Saturday night into Sunday, if you plan to go out Saturday night, might help to just go ahead and have the rain gear handy just in case you get caught under some of those showers, but they won't last for long. We're looking at partly cloudy skies on Sunday. 56 there is a high, 54 on Monday. Partly cloudy skies in store for us rolling into Monday before that sunshine comes back out on Tuesday. 58 there before we drop back down to the cooler temperatures. 50 on Wednesday evenings are slowly going to drop into those 30s Sunday night into next week.